Trouble walking or going up and down stairs. Arthritis of the knee can make mobility a real problem and impact your quality of life. The solution for many is a total knee replacement, but a new, less invasive option is undergoing trials and showing some promising results. Channel 2 anchor Lauren Freeman explains how the Calypso knee device works. Come on, guys. Go slow. Chuck Stanger used to be in pain. 33 years as a professional firefighter took a toll on his joints. Auto accident scene. I was on the fire department. Kneeling down to treat a patient. And it felt almost like a nail was going through my knee. It wasn't a nail. It was arthritis. Chuck struggled for years with pain and was considering knee replacement when he learned about a new option. Yeah, it's kind of compressing down like you would see with a shock absorber. The Calypso knee system is being tested at the Ohio State University Medical Center. Surgeons make a six inch incision on the inside of the knee and insert the device. You're putting a shock absorber outside the knee joint on the inner portion of the knee so that when they are walking, that shock absorber takes some of that load off. Doctors hope the device will delay or eliminate a patient's need to have knee replacement. Chuck was the first patient in the country to have the Calypso implanted. The second day post-op, I'd put the crutches away. You know, the actual device is right there. There's a small bump on the side of his knee. Otherwise, Chuck can't feel the device, but he knows it's working. You know, walking to dogs is, is not a problem now up and down stairs with this Calypso. If it works for me, I hope it helps a lot of other people too. Yeah, good boy. For now, back on his feet, almost pain free. Researchers are studying the Calypso knee device in 80 patients before deciding if it will be available nationwide. In European studies, the implant has provided pain relief for a decade in some patients. Lauren Freeman, KPRC, Channel 2 News.